day in May. Hi everyone, I'm Taryn from The Sirens, the Screen Sirens for Science, and I am here to tell you about a controversy that is even bigger than what Kim and Kanye decided to call their next kid. That's right, I'm talking about the element hassium. Hassium is element number 108, and its symbol is H with a little s. Hassium is one of only 24 synthetic elements. That means it doesn't occur in nature, much like Kim Kardashian. Even with its most stable isotope, 269, its half-life is only 9.7 seconds, which is significantly shorter than how long it's going to take me to tell you the story about how it got its name. In 1978, the Russians tried to synthesize the element 108. Six years later, a German team from the state of Hesse successfully synthesized three atoms of element 108. The International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry recognized both teams, but said that the Germans sealed the deal, and so they were able to name the element Hassium after the state where the team resided, in the state of Hesse. But wait, there's more! In 1979, the IUPAC suggested that it be named, wait a second, let me check this out, Unaloctium. 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 And this was even before it had been synthesized. But according to Mendeleev's nomenclature, we remember Mendeleev, right? The guy who made the periodic table. He thought hassium should be called echo-osium. Scientists in the field, they just, they wash their hands. What is this element 108? We're just gonna call it hassium. So luckily, everybody else has sort of gotten on board with calling it hassium. And considering that there have only been about, ooh, 100 hassium atoms ever synthesized in the lab, I think that's pretty reasonable. Don't blame me if Kim and Kanye name their next kid Hassium later. 